step off the train I'm walking down your street again And past your door Hi everybody, this is Roxy and I have some ephemera packs for sale. Um, I'm not going to sell these with books. I had previously mentioned that I would. I'm going to do the ephemera separate and then um, books separately. Uh, so these are $13 shipped. What you see is going to be indicative of what everyone has. Um, I've got eight lots, so it's going to be first come, first serve. Um, and pay, friends and family PayPal only. The ins instructions are in the um, description box below, as well as running across the top. Um, but also, you need to send that to your paper pantry at comcast.net. Uh, again, I'm going to do first come, first serve. If anybody pays past the sale of all eight, I will refund your money as soon as possible. All right, so on to the lots. Hi everybody, this is Roxy and I am um, selling some of my ephemera. Um, some of it is um, our photos or artwork that I um, downloaded or um, co and copied off on um, really good quality white paper. It's kind of a copy paper so you can decoupage and um, journal with it or do mixed media. Um, but this is indicative of every pack. In other words, it's not going to be exactly the same uh, ephemera, but it's going to be this much. And um, like the lace is going to be different, but you're going to get, you know, a good amount of it like that. Then you're all going to get photos, but they're going to be different. Everybody will get probably some flash cards, but they are, are different. So on with what I have. So this particular one has all these little lace pieces <clears throat> and they'll have you know like doilies or pieces of lace it's pretty with the little rose like that little doily too just think of how much time it took them to make this stuff and it's just getting thrown away by anybody cleaning out their parents or grandparents stuff. So here are these photos from this pack. But again, it's going to be very indicative of the same that you'll get. Pardon my fingernail, I just broke it. I love those two. Isn't that cool? Look at her hair. That's definitely 40s. So cool. That's a cool old photo of a path. Oh, I love photos. And my nail's so icky. I'll hide it. That little guy, look at that. Somebody probably knows where that rock is. And that little family. This, I think, is a copy, yeah. Okay. Then, we've got a couple of little, like, notices. Isn't that cool? Forrest Throckmorton. Throckmorton. 1952. Isn't that cool? And then just some tags I cut out of little cards. There's going to be cards in every one. There's Christmassy stuff. This is really cool. I don't remember where I got this. I think at an antique store. But it's a desert rat scrapbook. The newspaper that grows as you turn each page, excepting page five. So this is probably from the 70s, I'm gonna guess. Oh geez, no. Hmm. Hmm. 46 and 47. 
All right, so there's that. That's a little baby. These are my relatives. That's my mother-in-law and father-in-law and sister-in-law. These are some um, friendship cards. These are photos of, or copies of an old word catalog that I had, like from 1905, 1905, or under 1910, I don't remember what year. Nope, nope, you know what it was? Yeah, because it's Gibson. There might be a date somewhere. No, this is Sears and Roebuck, this one. Never mind. It's a Sears and Roebuck catalog I had instead. These are just old cool. And then these are um, really nice high quality paper too. Everybody will get some decals. There should be some in every one, I should say. Um, those are cool. These are red lead that I had purchased. Some ladies, stuff that I put together there. Some more. Romantic vampires. They're not in every one. Not pretty. Oh, I love that. Here's another decal. My cats. This is from an old book I had. And it was just, it's so brittle that that you'll have to copy or this is an old book, photo book or, yeah, it was photo and artwork. So there's a bunch of those pages. Cool. Look at the elephants. Isn't that cool? It's an old circus. Marceline, the famous clown. It must be French, but it's in English. And then... A chunk of this graph paper that's old, old, old. And then um, some pages from my recipe book. Another page. This was a writing book I had. Mm hmm. That was a re, uh, retro, you know, some cute little, look at pop-up. <laughs> An old um, IBM kind of card. See, that's the handwriting book. And a really pretty old postcard. East Northfield, Massachusetts. Some music paper. Another copy of something. Yahtzee, that's old. 